Arsenal Fan TV, Mo, what a performance by Eddie Enkatia. No, no, pronunciation. It's oh, all okay. about pronunciation. It's, it's, it's killed me the pronunciation. No, this, is, this is from Kalechi himself, all right? So I'm going to trust him. He's the authority on this. Eddie Enkatia. All right? That's the pronunciation, <laughs> right? So, we, so we've got right. to get that right. And listen, what, uh, what an introduction. First things first, man. Anyone that has followed him in the under-23s is not surprised today. He has mm. been absolutely smashing it for the under-23s. Every, every time you check a scoreline, he's scored a goal. He's just been on fire for them. The boy is quality. He just gets goals. He just knows mm. how to get goals. But what really impressed me today, I mean, look, that eight seconds to score a goal with your first touch, that's one thing. But then the burst of pace when he was on his hat trick, mm. that, is just, that just shows raw, raw pace. And um, his, his calm head when he's taking the ball to the corner. Mm. Even again, he was uh, free down the right-hand side and obviously he wants to go for his hat-trick, but still found someone, played the mm. pass, did the unselfish thing. The boy's got a very cool head on him. And I've been wanting him to start in the Europa League, especially a game or get some minutes. And I don't know why he hasn't. And I just always thought, right, maybe he's not ready. But on tonight's performance, man, he is ready. He's mm. more than ready. Is it exciting times for us then at Arsenal when it comes to these young players? You've got Rhys Nelson, you've got Eddie now, you've, um, Nate Lamars is coming through. Wenger keeps saying that, listen, he's knocking right on the door didn't have a great some games tonight. Yeah. That's not really his position. You know, um, you've got Tuba Akpom, you've got Willock, who in the, in, in the last game, I remember DT saying how great he played uh, in Belgrade. I mean, these guys now that are knocking on the door. Look, man, um, as far as all these youngsters that you've said, that you've talked about, I don't think any of them, at any point in their first team career, have had a ground, have had a stadium on the edge of their seat like Eddie did today. He was just something else. To me, he reminded me of Nicholas Anelka. When he first came on the scene for Arsenal, I was just looking at him thinking, wow, he's, he's above his years. And he's got me on the edge of my seat. Exciting, mm. seriously exciting players. And I haven't seen many like that to that extent. And I've been following the Ketia, as I say, in the uh, under-23s. I didn't know he'd have that in his locker playing in the first team. So mm. of all of the youngsters, this is the one I'm most excited about. Some players have just got that raw talent. And... I don't know, it's one of those things now where we, do we protect him or do we just chuck him in and do say, you, do you know what? Would you, would you come Saturday against Swansea say, right, Eddie, you're on the bench? Yeah, for sure, for sure. I thought you were mm. going to say, would you put him in the starting lineup? I'm, mm. I would have said no. But yeah, on the bench for sure. I mean, look, if, we, if we're a couple of goals out with five minutes to go, give him a run out again. Because and it would look, excite the crowd, wouldn't it? Him oh, coming big on. time, big mm. time. And do you know what? What a feeling for him today. When he woke up this morning, he would not have expected the whole stadium to be chanting his name like they were today. Mm. Just what a brilliant this is, story. This is one of those um, goosebumps moments in football, isn't it? Amazing. Uh, somebody amazing. who you've, you know, before he came on, no, but everyone was like, who's he? What's yeah, he going to yeah, do? Exactly, yeah. And now he's I a hero. Um, when Arsenal tweeted the substitution, the mm. replies to that were just making me laugh. I was retweeting some of them. And, you know, they were just saying, oh, what the hell is this about? Who's this geezer? He's not going to do anything. And then he goes and scores two goals and wins us a game. Mm. It's Roy of the Rovers stuff. Or, or for the youngsters now, it's... Uh, FIFA. Alex Hunter. It's Alex Hunter <laughs> yeah. stuff. Do you know what I mean? This is crazy. What he's gone and done today is mad. I was willing him to get the hat trick, uh, hat trick today, but look, he's a raw talent that has driven the Arsenal fans delirious today. Mm. You might get the reference, Eddie Murphy. This is the Eddie Murphy fixture. Murphy scores first, Eddie scores the next two. So Eddie Murphy fixture is going to be remembered as that, man. Mm. And to top it off, he gave his shirt to a little kid as well. The boy can do no wrong. Eddie Nketiah, you're the future. The Ultimate Football Fan is now here. Listen, if you want the best content, things like Blood Brothers, exclusive content only here from Arsenal Fan TV, you've got to check out the Ultimate Football Fan. Go to the Indiegogo link. Be one of the first to get on board with this. Arsenal Fan TV are live on here. Ultimate Football Fan.